Blake here from Tales from the Trails and today we are looking at something a little bit different. It is the Metal Gear Solid Master Collection Volume 1. The Metal Gear Solid series have been going back for pretty much decades. I think I think it's 35 years now. First up, we're going to have a look at a message from the development team. We thank you and sincerely appreciate your continuous support. Currently, the development team are working together to create an environment where fans can experience and enjoy the Metal Gear series on the latest platforms. We are remaking the Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater, one of the most beloved installments of the Metal Gear series, revealing the origin story of Snake as Metal Gear Solid, a Snake Eater. We're working hard for Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater to be a faithful recreation of the original story and game design while evolving the gameplay with stunning visuals and a seamless user experience. Simultaneously, we will deliver the Metal Gear Solid Master Collection series, the most complete compilation that celebrates the 35th anniversary of the series. The Metal Gear Solid Master Collection allows fans to play the games as they were, as first released on the latest platforms. We hope you will enjoy the Metal Gear series on the latest platforms. Regards, the development team. And as we can see here, we have Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty and Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater and they are part of the collection along with a few other things. The official trailer, which is what we're going to look at right now, is essentially it tells you about all the different games in the series well in the master collection and there are five games i believe and a bunch of extra content and special stuff and guides so let's just watch this video this is one of the official videos and it takes you through the timeline of when all these different events happened when each of the you know the games in the series also released 35 years that is incredible for a game series absolutely amazing i played mostly um metal gear solid i mean not the it's like the first of the 3d ones metal gear solid which is part of this collection i loved the the mission in particular where you had to go in a cardboard box in the snow and you get a little wolf puppy to pee on your box and then you can get through the wolf cave because you smell of dog, or wolf even. Silly little thing, but, you know, I enjoyed it. And yeah, it's... Oh, Psycho Mantis. He was an enemy. I He's the only enemy I really didn't like. Just could not figure him out. He killed my character so many times. He, like, teleports. He gets in your brain. It, ooh. A tough cookie. A tough cookie. Yes, the collection. Let's have another look at a few different things. So yes, you get the three 3D games, you get the 2D games, and you get a bunch of extras as well. So you get your Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear Solid 2, uh, Metal Gear Solid 3, the original 2 as well. Um, and yeah, you get a load of extra content as well with this particular pack. We do get a little preview on here. I do have it. I do have the games and I do have the collection. I'm going to scroll down and these are the bonus content what you get. The soundtracks as well. Graphic novels. Pretty cool. Very nice to have. Nice to have a look at. Nice to have a good read through as well. And what is really good is they let you know firsthand on the site is the output resolution and frame rate what frame weight frame rate what to expect with the different consoles and platforms you play the game on most of it is in 1080 with an exception of the handheld switch playstation 5 playstation 4 xbox series x and s the switch on the handheld the nintendo switch on the pc on the pc nope on the tv even and steam which means pc so yes the output resolutions you know yeah cool awesome so for the first game metal gear solid it is all pretty much 1080p apart from the handheld version of the switch and for the metal gear solid 2 sons of liberty and metal gear solid 3 snake eater we are expecting 1080p for everything apart from 
a switch on handheld again with also a reduced frame rate. Best frame rate all around is for the second games on all the consoles except the Switch, unfortunately. Sorry Switch players, but it is PC and console mostly for a 60 FPS. Moving on from those frame rates and resolution settings, we're going to have a quick look at the extra bonus content. We do have the audio or score from the games themselves and we have the track list. It lists it all there right in front of you. You know, you can find this information on their own website, which I will link below as well. And yeah, you've got your, your Metal Gear Solid games, you've got your original games, and you have these, which are samples, which I'm showing you because I'm not showing you the whole thing, of the guides which also come with the games. That was Metal Gear Solid. This is Metal Gear Solid 2. I did play this game as well. Raiden. I think, was his name Jack? His normal name was Jack, I think it was. Raiden or Raiden. Anyway. I did call him Snake at one point. A different type of snake, snake, I guess. So this is Metal Gear Solid 3. I do vaguely remember playing this one. Not strongly in my mind, but I definitely played it. I did definitely play this one. And then at the bottom here, we have the original two games. And we have the guides for those as well, which is really cool to have. I mean, these things do get lost over time. Especially with such an old, you know, old game. So yeah, it's definitely worth looking at these. We'll just scroll down to the bottom. It has more expert information about each of the games, if you're unfamiliar. It shows you screenshots. The first two are 2D, because they are significantly older, but no, you know, they're, they're not bad. They're, they're good games. Metal Gear Solid, which was the first one, uh, 3D, which I was introduced to with the cardboard boxes. I love those cardboard boxes so much. And we've got <laughs> Sons of Liberty, Metal Gear Solid 2, and Snake Eater, Metal Gear Solid 3. And if anybody did pre-order it for the day one bonus, they got some pins, some pretty pins, which are kind of cool. A pin's very collectible now. So yeah, when you install it to your console, this is on my PlayStation 4, you know, you get your, you get them all installed just like that. You get one, two, three, four, five different things. You get Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid 2, Metal Gear Solid 3, and then you get the, the first two games packed together, which is slightly to the right, at left even, right now. And then you get your bonus content with all the, the music and the guides and things like that at the end. There you go. I hope you found this video useful in some way, shape or form. If you don't subscribe already, please do so. And happy trails out there.